Oscar. Leave those muddy loafers on the shoe mat, take some booties from the booty basket, and place them on your feet. Debuting on February 19th on CBS, right after ratings behemoth The Big Bang Theory, and right before the series finale of Two and a Half Men, the new version of The Odd Couple is a well-placed reboot with absolutely no reason to exist except to perpetuate a laugh track and a slew of stalking, gay, ex-wives, and friends with benefit jokes that aren't actually funny and delivered by actors who deserve better. Well, there's that, and the need to fill a slot on CBS now that Two and a Half Men is over. Not that I'm sure that that is enough. Even with a beloved legacy as The Odd Couple has, and the co-star and executive producer Matthew Perry has. You are now single in the greatest city in the world. This town is teeming with women. Hey, move it, you jackasses! See, there's one. Now, if you ever watched TV in the last half of the 20th century, you know that the original Odd Couple ran for almost five hilarious years on ABC in the early 70s, starring Tony Randall as the fastidious Felix Unger and Jack Klugman as the slobbish Oscar Madison. It was a reboot of a sort itself even then. Now opposites attract, but they also drive each other crazy. And in the process, the original Odd Couple hit upon many of the currents of the changing America of the time. Hell, there was even a new Odd Couple with African-American leads produced by original producer Gary Marshall on ABC back in 1982. While it has an opening tune a lot like the original from the 70s and a snazzy opening credit sequence, this latest version starring Perry and the trying as best as he can Thomas Lennon isn't that. In fact, it's just crazy making and how canned and creaky it all is. There's another one? He's got him stashed all over the apartment like an alcoholic. In fact, the pilot has almost all the conflicts between the two worked out by the end. So, you know, the rest of this mid-season replacement will just really be variations on a very old school theme. Now, CBS's older demo jokes aside, this already smells a lot more like the McCarthy's than Mom, if you know what I mean. In many ways, all I could think about while watching this new Odd Couple was poor Matthew Perry. Now, I don't mean that in a victim way at all, but after the post-Friends comedy flameouts of Mr. Sunshine on ABC and Go On on NBC, this Odd Couple reboot is very much his vehicle and very much his baby, even with some tweaks in the process of series and Marshall on board as a consultant. Perry not only co-stars and EPs the show, but he nurtured this new version of the old show and co-wrote the uninspiring pilot. So look, this has to sit on his shoulders, but I have to say, watching him shout rather than speak most of these terrible lines on the new Odd Couple, I can't think that the Odd Couple deserves better. But then again, I gotta tell you, when it comes to the new Odd Couple, so do we. I'm Dominic Patton for Deadline Hollywood.